country, and timeless classics. From their family to your family, by way of Nashville, Tennessee, here in Duluth, ladies and gentlemen, the 50th annual Duluth Folk Sports Travel RV and Deer Classic is proud to present our star performers. Please welcome the Willis family!
much. How's everybody doing today? Good? Yeah. Okay, now, I gotta tell you, from my point of view, it's kind of dark out there, and I can't see you all, so if you're there, you're really not, you need to let me hear you, so let me ask one more time. How's everybody doing today? Yeah. That's good. I'm excited. This is gonna be a good show. We are the Willis Clan from Nashville, Tennessee, and we are super excited to be sharing our music and our dance with you guys over the next little bit, and I hope you enjoy it. Um, that was a song off of our, the first song off of our latest CD, and we want to continue right away with another song um, from that same record. And I just want to spotlight uh, real quick two really exciting things, namely these two little guys that are joining us up here in the front for this number. This is our brother Jager, who's just six years old, going to be rocking out on his electric guitar. And then the lovely Miss Jada, she is just five, she is the youngest kid in our family, and she's been practicing her tambourine so very hard, wants to play that for you guys. Thank you. I'm going to Okay, so this is a song called Carry Away. Here we go. Alrighty, so a little word of um, 
explanation for us. We got started off in traditional Irish music and uh, play a lot of different genres now. Um, play bluegrass, pop, a little bit of rock and roll, and most of all, we like to mix it all together. But I do want to ask, do we have any fans of country or bluegrass music here today? Seems a fair amount. All right, so um, good, because I was wondering because we're going to do one in that stop. We're actually going to feature um, our brother Jeremiah and our sister Jennifer singing. This is a track off of our second album and it's called Nervous Breakdown. And we've been living in Nashville for about 15 years now and it's an amazing town for music. If you've never been, you definitely got to visit. There's so many legendary places around and it has definitely influenced our sound a lot. So, and we're, we're kind of lucky because we have some people in the Pretty multi-talented, and they're switching around instruments. We even have a banjo on this next number. If you cheer really loud, maybe he'll give us a little bit of a banjo solo. Do we have any fans of the banjo here? families like it as well. And uh, so we put our own twist on um, one of the classic songs from that uh, musical. And this of course is our version of A Few of My Favorite Things. Cause I'm careless, I'm riding cowboy cattle, saying no one man. 
secret weapons. Just five and six man attitude. Well, they're actually going to stay out here on this next one as well. And uh, we're going to stay in the Sound of Music vein for just one more number. And uh, this is the lovely song, Edelweiss, if you know it, please sing along. And uh, we do have something special on this number. We had the chance to show, um, uh, let you guys see our brother Jeremiah play a very fascinating um, instrument here called the Illin Pipes. Um, they're like the Irish version of the bagpipes, much sweeter and uh, used for laments and slower beautiful songs. So um, it's, a, it's a very challenging instrument and an absolutely beautiful sound. So he's got a solo on this one, Edelweiss. Jackson beating on the drums. He is 17 and are equally handsome. Well, there's a big debate going on. We have our equally brother handsome uh, brother Jedi playing bass there, but Jackson's really trying to grow a beard. So right now, see, Jared's got the glorious beard. That's definitely checks off. Jackson, he's got a little bit of a goat beard. You can come by in the merch line. Tell us if you think it's a yes or no. And Jedi's still going for the fresh baby face look. So there you go. 
Well, let's hear it for the boys. After Jenna, we have our sister Jasmine back there playing keys. She is 14 years old. We have Julie on harp. She is 12. Jamie over there on cymbals. She is 10. And then Miss Joy on keyboards. And she is 9. So let's hear it for the ladies in the back row. guitar for us is in fact our mother Brenda so let's please give it up for mom on guitar and then uh, last but certainly not least this guy works really hard to make us sound good this is our dad Toby out front running sound so let's give it up for dad Um, what we want to do now is the title track off of our latest album, and I just want to say thank you to anybody who might have bought that album, Heaven, when it came out uh, earlier this past summer. Um, it definitely has been our most successful record so far, and uh, because some of you people downloaded it right away, it jumped up to number six on the iTunes pop charts, which means at one point we were just a few spaces away. There was Taylor Swift, Walk the Moon, Us, and then Beyonce. So that's pretty cool. Give yourselves a round of applause for that. I think our friend Ron Backer is here also with some of his family's beautiful wife, Jeanette, and their daughter, Amanda. And we just want to say thank you to Ron because he was huge and instrumental in getting that album out. So you can all give a round of applause for Mr. Ron, our friend here, uh, for helping us out um, and leading in our music. All right. Okay, so here we are. Like I said, we're going to give you the title tracks. This is the song, Heaven. Oh 
Alrighty, I don't know if there's any fans out there of our TLC show, but I have great news for you guys. Um, commercials have started running the last few days on TLC. They have officially announced the premiere date for the new season, and that is March 15th. So set your DVRs, break your calendars, whatever you need to do. We're really excited. We've been filming for a while now, and uh, just really looking forward to getting that out for you guys. So there's that. The other thing I wanted to let you know about, we can talk about it um, after the show if you'd like, you can come back and meet us um, right behind the stage. We'll be selling CDs and t-shirts and things like that, take pictures. But uh, make sure to ask us about our tour to Ireland. Uh, I think it was mentioned in the intro, but um, we go over about once a year now and uh, we've started taking fans with us. You guys can sign up, you can come along. Uh, we have a little package we put together. Um, we go around, we travel, we see different sites, we go to castles, um, there's concerts and music just about every night. So it's a really, really amazing, fun experience. And if you're interested, you can go to our website, thewillisclan.com, to learn more information. I think there's about 20 seats left for our next trip, which is in June. June 19th through 26th. So if you've got that spot open in your calendar and you're interested, again, please talk to us. Um, so we have time for just one more. And I uh, want to do the last number off of our first album. It's called Blast Reels. And if we can get the little kids to come out and dance again, please make them welcome if they do that. So, um, huh? Oh, yes. Before we go, we should mention, um, anybody like our sister Jennifer's fashion today? She's got a new shirt. It's pretty awesome. It's pretty blingy. We actually got it from the Harley place down here. I think Dad bought the whole entire shop. Um, except for the bikes. So all the clothes. But no, no bikes. Um, yesterday, Jay, or actually, was he talking to you, Jen? Or when we when we got here, um, we, this is the second trade show we played in a row, and at the previous one, there was a big pond of trout in front of us, and I think we took a poll in our family. I mean, fishing is really fun, but you gotta we gotta say we prefer the Harley scene. Um, Jeanette just wants to know if she can go fishing for a Harley. If she catches it, does she get to keep it, or does she have to pay for it? <laughs> I'm putting words in her mouth. Okay. So we're going to stop chatting. Thank you so much, guys, for listening. I hope you guys have had a fun time. Do not forget, we come back and we play again tonight at 9. It will be completely different from this show. So think of it as the second half of the show. We'd love for you guys to come back. You've been a lot of fun. You've been our best audience all day. <laughs> Does that make you feel good? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, again, yeah, please, please come back. We'll be awfully lonely without you. Whenever you're ready, Jer, last words.
our star performers, please welcome the Willis family. <laughs> First of all, can you hear me? Yeah. You can hear this. Can you hear this? Yeah. All right. So some things are working. We have a little bit of a technical difficulty. Do you want to try that? Do you want to try that, or do you want to go to the next one? What do you want to do? Okay. I think we're gonna go for take two on that. Okay. Make okay. Sure all the electronic parts are working. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, actually, you know what? We did that on purpose. That was a, just a test to see if you guys were out there. Is anybody out there? Oh. oh, okay. All right. So now we know. Let's try that again. <laughs>
second time's the charm, I guess, for that one today. Hello, we are the Willis Clan, and uh, we are just a really big family from Nashville, Tennessee, that likes to do a lot of different styles of music and dance. We performed earlier in the day um, at four, and I just want to say thank you. Um, before the lights end down, I definitely saw some of you same guys coming back um, for what we like to think of as the second half of the show, so thanks for sticking around, and uh, looking forward to having some fun with you guys over the next little bit. Uh, that was a tune of ours, I'm written by our brother Jeremiah here, uh, called Chase and Love, off of our latest album. It's a fun, uh, it, it's, it's a fun confusing piece sometimes, because you try and explain it, and it's an anthem, song, jam, tune, instrumental thing. So, um, just wanted to start off with that one there. And uh, we're going to continue here with a song off the latest album. It's called Don't Leave Me Tonight. Don't leave me
to genre hop, if you will. We do a lot of different styles of music and enjoy them all. We got started off in traditional Irish music and um, explored a lot of other, um, you know, overlaps with folk, with bluegrass, um, into country. We've now lived in Nashville for 15 years, so that makes itself known in our music. And um, we've had a lot of cool um, influences, even contemporary music and rock and pop and things like that. Um, so we always try and keep our Irish roots showing. Uh, we're proud of them. And, but this next one is probably most strongly bluegrass. And uh, it was written by some of the boys um, here, Jackson, Jeremiah. It's called Wild and Free. Maybe you could have guessed it was the boys that came up with uh, the core of this song. And uh, Jer starts off with a really cool guitar part. So whenever you're ready, Jer. every show that we can. Um, we want to show off some of our um, siblings dancing ability here. We are definitely musicians and we love sharing our music with people, but fun fact, we were actually a dance troupe before we were a band. Um, we got started off in some traditional Irish step dancing and uh, that got us traveling all across the nation and even over to Ireland for the first few times to compete and to showcase this um, fabulous folk dance um, that uh, people are so impressed with. And um, the traveling exposes to a lot of other dance styles, things such as barn dance, swing dance, hip hop, things like that. And uh, we have four national swing dance champs in our family, and they want to show you something here called West Coast Swing. And uh, it's a lot of fun, and uh, we're starting, hopefully starting to bring it back and make people more aware of it. Um, and it's, it's obviously more popular out in California on the West Coast, but uh, we love it so much. And we're going to have Jenny and Jack start it off for you guys. And the more you hoop, holler, and cheer, the better I can guarantee that they're going to dance, okay? Yeah! Here are those people, those are the people who've been to our show 
notes before. So you just follow their lead and you'll be all good. All right, Jenny Jen. right in front of us here. Um, at the last week, we, this is the second trade show we've done in a row, and at uh, the previous one we had a trout pond right in front of us and tons and tons of boats that we could see. And, uh, you know, I know I know there's, I mean, I'm seeing some over here, so it's not, it's not too far of a, of a stretch. Um, but uh, this, this next song all takes place on the, on the water, um, on the sea, as it were. And um, I actually wrote this when we were over in Ireland as the first song that I ever wrote while we were over there. And we were actually on the ocean. We were on um, like a ferry uh, boat, as in not ferry wings, uh, ferry boat. And we were seeing um, some gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. <sighs> Which one? 
I just, the kids just pointed out that I have kind of introduced two songs and they're asking me which one I'm talking about. Which one do you want to do? Okay, why don't we have a wrestling match and whoever wins, we get to do the song they want to do. Okay. Everybody, for song A, give a nice cheer. Okay, for song B, give a nice cheer. Okay, song B, we're gonna make Jack B song B because that makes sense. Okay, so just get ready for Jack B, which is what I was introducing, actually. So, this was the first song that I wrote while we were over in Ireland, and I am so sorry, band and sound man, for accidentally introducing two songs there. <laughs> The funny thing, it, it's I was funny thinking though. Boat and Ireland and I just totally yeah. mixed the two up. Yeah, well, Sorry. this song, Jack B, is actually a great, it's a great song that was written by Jess. Um, unfortunately, it's, it's not a very nice song. It's a, it's a song that warns all young women against charming Irish sailor boys. And they are charming, let me tell you. Well, when we were over in Ireland, as Jessica was telling you, we took this ferry boat ride. And, um... See, in the song, this young girl falls in love with a sailor, and he rejects her, so she turns around and, you know, warns women against Irish sailors. So Jessica likes to claim this is a fictional story, because she feels very deeply hurt by what actually happened. And what made it worse is that the young sailor boy actually went out with me instead of her, so she's still sore about that. But, um... We don't mention that very often. Every once in a while, I just remind her that gentlemen prefer blondes. So. Yes, but they marry the blondes. So. <laughs> well, you know, the funny thing is that the the sailor he said that he didn't he he wasn't into blondes, which is really funny because Jess is actually naturally a brunette, so it was just like really bad for her. It's very unfortunate. No to self, never misintroduce a song because Jen starts talking. <laughs> All right, are we good? I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> I think we're in here.
to sing, and particularly hard to play a whistle when you're laughing. <laughs> that just like happened out of nowhere, or was that like, I, I didn't see that coming. Jackson, the mischievous uh, drum player back there. Jack's actually playing something called Baran, and uh, that is a, pretty much the only traditional Irish drum that they play over there. Um, what do you guys, what do you guys want to do? We're, we're kind of like really like loose and comfortable. We've been playing here the last few days and is everybody still having a good time? Woo! All right, so we had a request from the family here too, to show you a little bit of something here. Um, we have three albums out, okay? So the first one's Irish, second one's bluegrass, third one's pop, and we're working on doing a country one right now, but we have a lot of, material that we've written that we honestly just haven't recorded and we do snippets of it here and there. This is actually, we're going to give you a sneak peek of a song that uh, only recently we just finished writing. Um, but uh, I just finished writing it, but we, we kind of just do a little acapella jam. You want to hear a little bit? Yeah. Just don't judge us too hard because we actually haven't worked this out yet. We're kind of making it up as we go. Okay, we're, just, we're just picking a key. <laughs> <laughs> Your true colors, true colors, never gonna fade away. Your true colors, true colors, gonna see the light of day. Your true colors, true colors, never gonna fade away. Your true colors, true colors, gonna see the light. So mark your calendars, write it down, set your DVR, whatever you need to. Um, we're really excited. They just started running commercials. So if you're watching TLC, we'll pop out there um, every once in a while. Um, so watch your calendars for that. And like I said, if you, if you follow us like on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram and our website and things, we'll let you know um, how the album's coming along. Um, we had some good de you know, delays, but good delays. And we'll get that out as soon as we can. Um, when we get home, we'll jump in the studio and work on that. So what shall we do next? Stuff off the latest album. This song is called So Close. And I know I kind of been chatting a little bit, but I do want to introduce everybody um, before the set is over. So just real quick rapid fire. Some of you may already know this, but this is our brother Jeremiah. He's 22 years old. Our sister Jennifer at 21 here. Miss Jeanette in the corner at 19. This is Brenda at 25. Haha. <laughs> this is our mom. Let's give it up. Uh, Julie over there on the harp. She's 12. Jasmine back there on the keys, she is 14. Jackson on the drums, he's 17. Jedi on running away. Jedi on the bass and he's 16. Miss Joanna back there, she is nine. And we're missing one. Ah, she was hiding behind Jackson. This is Miss, this is the funny set, I guess. Everybody thinks they're the funniest person in the world. So this is uh, Jamie. And now she's dying. Was that a cough or a sneeze or a hiccup or all of the above? Oh, she was drinking. <laughs> she was drinking. Uh, so she's 10 years old. She's back there on the cymbal. And that's why she things. was hiding, because she was drinking and she's only 10. <laughs> oh, okay. And I'm Jessica, and I'm 23, and I'm the oldest, and I like to talk. I think they already gathered okay, that, Jess. So, all right, so we're going to give you so close here. Hope you guys enjoy it.
Lauren, thank you so much guys for coming out today and, and watching us. We have one more show tomorrow um, at 4 p.m., which of course we want to invite you back to if you can. Um, if, if, um, yeah, if we finish up with this one, just want to let you know that afterwards we'll just be hanging out behind the stage and uh, if you want to get any t-shirts, CDs, say hi, get a picture, whatever, we will be back there and um, I already said the bit about the TV show and uh, there we have been pushing also and, and trying to let people know about the tour that we're taking to Ireland. If you have any questions, I'm not going to talk too long about it, but um, just want to invite you and if you have any, um, if you ever wanted to go to Ireland and you think you might want to go with us as your tour guides, uh, just go out and talk to us um, after the show because we have an opportunity for you to do just that this upcoming June. So we're really excited about that. All right, March 15th. Don't forget, that is our new premiere date. And uh, we're going to finish off with this song here called Plow and Song just because it is so much fun and it incorporates everybody at some point. Jen, start us off.